Okay folks, in episode 29 of season 2 of Fracking Universe, and we're going to do a bit more planet hopping. And I started to do it at the end of the last episode, um, but we're well, it was at the end of the episode where we do other stuff as well. So this time we're going to dedicate a bit more time to it. And see what else is out there, because, well, we haven't really been out on planets a lot for the last quite a lot of episodes. So I've come to this fairly random system with a lot in it. Stabbington, 29TKN. <laughs> uh, uh, there's quite a lot of stuff here, if you, if you just um, zoom out for a sec. We can see there's an absolute ton of planets for us to visit. Uh, still haven't actually... Oh, gas giant. Actually, this might be the gas giant, because we've never actually done um, a high-pressure thing in this, in this season, I don't seem to remember. Um, but we need extreme pressure protection, which at the moment I don't actually have. So that'll have to wait a little bit. But see what else is out here, actually. Oh, a red desert. Uh, what's this? Oh, it's a barren place. And a volcanic activity. It was a volcano. I'm not so interested in this bit, so let's go over to this one. I can't remember how to actually get the extreme pressure stuff. I'll have to look into that. Another volcano place. Well, I could try the Infernus. Let's just see what um, level of protection I've actually got. We may have to go back to the lab and improve our lot. Um, well, we've got... Well, we don't... I've actually got the cooling oil at the moment, but... It's also got that glide augment. Moderate to severe heat planets. Maybe... Let's have a go. That was a stupid interface. Times two. Extreme. Yeah, let's go to the Infernus. Pyrite or Got myself a little mining tool. Got myself all the other stuff that I've been gathering over the time, like um, the translocator, which I haven't really been using much of. What have I just done? Oh, <laughs> I pressed the button. Didn't quite press the button there. Let's see if this is actually going to hold up to our temperatures. No. Uh, I think I've only got enough for two. Um, yeah, I'm actually dying quite quickly here. Let's go with you. Oh, I haven't got air either. Can't believe there's actual tree just ligging about the place. Okay, but that might be a bit too hot for us. Unless, maybe if I go back to the lab, maybe we can actually increase things. Maybe... Hello, spoiler ape. Right, let's have a look. Um, I don't think this is going to be... Hmm. This has actually got a cold shield on it. Maybe this will actually work. If we just swap these around. Oh, so they may... Ooh, ah! So the mistake I made was um, I actually had the wrong armour on. The Mutavisc armour. I've replaced it with some Densinium armour. Uh, which is pretty much at our level. Possibly a bit below. Well, I haven't really been advancing much recently. So we can now explore this place without too much peril. There's quite a lot of good stuff on this planet. I've never really been here before. I'm just going to tonk everything with my... Surprisingly good... What was that? Oh! Oh. Right. Let's get in... Let's try and actually get down into a cave of some kind. Also, we'll need to be at tonking. Ow! Oh, oh, oh! Got zapped. Oh, everything's getting zapped. Let's get down here. Ugh. Oh, look! Bees! Oh, no! That was fairly... Yeah, straightforward. That's... <laughs> Didn't have to dig through there. Alright, there we go. Ah, scorched core. Get some really doing... Oh, so it's actually Cinnabar, that. Yeah, yeah, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. Getting quite a lot of good stuff already. Let's get you... Still some lightning. Hmm. So, what I really need to do is stay on the surface, though, because um, kind of like half the point of what I want to do is find kind of more obvious dungeony type things. So, I've got my Reaver, actually. Not usually get... Oh, actually. <laughs> Literally underneath a, one of those at the moment. Oh, very vanilla, those. Oh, God, I'm going to have to get rid of you. I wonder if that's him. I think my, um, one of my swords has actually got an elemental damage against him. Uh, hang on. There we go. I'm actually going to go back to the surface. Yeah, get my Reaver out for the lads. Uh, where is this? There it is. I think in the previous episode I used the Explore pod, which I really shouldn't have done because that wasn't... That's some... I'm not even sure I'm supposed to have that mod installed anymore, but... Oh, look at these! Actually, don't look at these. These are all nasty variants of ones we know and love. Yes! Blast you. Can't even remember when I got this. Oh, some pricks. Some bandit pricks. 
I've already picked up a few things. Oh, hang on. Get rid of you. Get rid of all of you. Sod off. But there seems to be some good tasty ones and things on the surface. Oh, gold drill. Bling. Also you. Nice little gun, plus some more bandages. Oh, I've actually been out of space for guns. Um, I'm never going to have a pet, am I? No. Come on, we need some more fracking universe type dungeons and things. Okay, let's get moving on to the um, next planets. So, what I was thinking of doing is... Um, I've been, well, I've been looking through here. Uh, I've been discovering that um, the pressure thing is actually quite easy to solve. Uh, we just need to go for... I mean, I've just made myself a hard suit. Um, but if we go for Valkyrie, Greaves and Full Helm, um, the set bonus is immunity from oxygen pressure, gas and radiation. So in theory, this should actually help us. Uh, I've got the synthetic material already. I need a bit more tritium. I think it's something that we did quite recently, this. Oh, there's a tri... yeah, tritanium bar. Fuck if I go... Remember to pick up some food. Full helm. Oh, there's two tots. Is there any difference? I think it's just visual. And Greaves. So. Let's see. Ah, helm. Right. Increased air mobility, reduced falling speed as well. So this should make it... Um, allow us to go to the, the gas giant. If I've not missed my guess. Hang on. Yeah, I can do that. <laughs> it's getting confused. Anyway, right. So, I've moved the ship a bit to in front of that gas giant that we saw earlier. So I'm hoping this is going to work. So I think, I think we did it back, this back in Season 1. Very briefly, maybe towards the end. Right, let's have a go. Oh, for f <sighs> Is it going to be this dark? Is it just night time? Or is it... I don't know. Can't see a thing. Also, is that... Native wildlife want to devour you? Is it going to be Urchius type stuff? Oh, I don't know. Um, so it looks like we're not dead, although the gravity is a bit piss. Sandstorm. This is not ideal. We really need a, a Xenon light pack or something. Because at the moment we've got a cooling thing, which is not very handy. I think I've actually got one. Hang on. Diamond Lantern. Yeah, there we go. Oh, ow, 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 ow. Okay, that was cooling us down. Piss. <laughs> well, we can either have light or stay alive, really. Alright. Um, it did... Yeah. It, morning came. I can't remember how these things work. Because this is just a floating island at the moment. Oh, look, there's a, um, there's a flying bum monster. Yeah. Although it's, just not, it's not purple for once. Yeah. Let's see what this stuff is. Oh, it's just burning volcanic rock. I don't really want that. Ah, oh, Trianglium. Good old Trianglium. Also some Prismic Shards. That's very handy. Probably a... Yeah. Maybe new stuff. That unlocks some... Anyway, let's let's risk it. This is going to be a bit of a risk. What's going to happen? <laughs> uh, do... Where do we go? Where do we go now? Um, Is this just going to fall to the death? Hmm. Can't remember what these things were like last time I went. Mercury? Yeah. This doesn't look like it's going to be very useful. I've got a translocator. Maybe if I, um... Hang on, let's have a look. Let's have another go with this. Is there anywhere we can actually go here, or is this just a big old waste of time? Seems like there's nowhere to go. Unless I fly. Oh yeah, I can fly. <laughs> ah. Do 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 donk. Oh some blue stuff. Is that eflu effluvium? It's there's something which I don't think I've actually got. 
Let's have a look. Oh, oh it's Iradium! Actually, this, actually this, is, um, this is Godot City, isn't it? All the stuff that I don't normally get to see much of. What's that over there? There's more prismic stuff. Doing, doing, doing. Yeah, more iradium. This is still a little bit of a pain to dig through. Uh, I didn't really um, I didn't. What is it? This is the um, the DB, the D4B. So I went about halfway through the um, these things. Oh, it's crystal Urtius. Yeah, that is a problem. Getting back up again, especially when there's a maggot man. Oh, this is a, this is that oyster stuff that we got last time. Oh, I'm buried. Oh, I'm still buried. Ha! Huh. No, we out of here. No, let's get out of there. Well, that wasn't much of a place. I'm most disappointed. I think we might want to move on to another planet. Let's have a look. There's loads of ships around. Now, let's see what else there actually is here. That was an unknown planet. Ooh. Um, is there anything else? I mean, there's any in Eden. As I say, I'm not trying necessarily to get to the, the hardest planets. I just want to get find find some more dungeon type stuff, more than anything. But I think that might be the unknown planet. That's always a bit of fun. Apart from last time, where we tried that planet and it was piss. I think it was. I can't remember what was going on. Right, all the way across the galaxy. And part of this is trying to find stuff I haven't, really, I haven't seen. I didn't see in the last season when we did a lot of planets hopping. There's actually a rocket launcher. Yeah, it is. I could take this guy with me. He was um, stuck in the um, whatever the hell I called this, the far tactic. I think he was. Yeah, come along with me, mate. Just for once. It's been a while. Now this is the end. Oh, it's tar covered world. Not what I wanted. Heat protection for this. Well, I'll have a go. But there's a huge amount of point. I was, I, hope, I was hoping this was the unknown planet, but it didn't. Oh, it's dark again! <sighs> Better with the darkness. Always bloody dark. Right. Because I, I have a horrible feeling that this is another place where I won't be able to take this off. Yeah. This requires a bit of cold protection. I found a wand on that first planet. Fungal icor. Oh, so that's where you get that from. Well, yes, I've already got it before. I've got a whole, I think I've got it. I've had it before. I must have done. But this is actually getting us some good stuff. Oh. Doesn't seem very oily so far. Although now, unfortunately, I've got that bloody glide thing on. It's part of my EPP. So that's why I'm so I can not moving in the way that you might expect. Yeah, glide, 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 glide. Not a huge fan of it. Oh! I mean, some it. It's not oil, though. Oh, there's some oil down there. Oh, there's a big one. Oh, wow, that's a big one. Oh, ow, 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 ow. Uh, what can I shoot it with? I've made you immune to poisons. Oh, well, thank you very much. Uh, that was useful. More fungal icor. It's got to be useful for something. Right, I think it's. I think I just have to get onto, into the Reaver again. See what else is out there. Fungal icor is actually quite a good thing. It gives you quite a. Well, it opens up a few things. Yeah, what's that? Huh. That's weird. Not quite sure what there's um, what all that stuff's going on down there. Open this chest. Tar. <laughs> no. Right, open this. Why is there an underground farm? I'm not sure if this is a, a weird spawning thing or... Oh, look, it's a wormy worm. Um, a little twat that you are. Oh, well, that's um, it's going to you. Oh, careful. Uh, oh, that's hurting. That is hurting. Give it some colour. There we go. Pasak? 
What's that? Pesaka ball, eh? Huh. Good for you. And another great big axe. Which I'm, I'm just not picking up any of these things. I don't need any weapons at the moment. It appears to be going dark again. Fancy building a house down here. What's going on down there? There's something there. Not quite sure what. Hmm. It's a strange old place, this. Right, we've come to a... We've come to the actual unknown planet one now. Which also has a desert. A rather basic desert. Hmm. Did I actually... No, I didn't. Damn it. No, we're going there. So I really should get some more food. I think I'm pretty much out. I think I've got one raw steak. Which cannot be ideal. Well, at least it's not totally dark. <sighs> God damn it. Oh, screen. Oh, blimey. That's bright. So as usual, the, the unknown planets, it can be just an absolute nonsense hodgepodge of random biomes. So it could be completely deadly and evil. It has a very toxic feel, but it's not. Well, the, the greenness is toxic. looks toxic, but it's not. It's most odd. Feels fairly... Hang on, what's this? Tropical heat. Oh, it's tropical heat, so it's kind of jungly type temperature. So nothing too bad. That's all plant matter. This is incredibly dark, though. I wonder we may be able to do the light thing on this one. Thank God. Especially because it's getting towards night. It's an unusual place. Weird trees. Oh, fireflies as well. This glide is showing that I don't jump to my death at least. But it's still a bit confusing to actually operate. Oh, carrots. Beep! Oh, now I'm burning for some reason. What was that? Oh, it's a dinosaur! Oh, now it isn't. <laughs> oh, planet of the dinosaurs. The land that time forgot. And now it's turned into slime. Plus an evil tree! Look how evil that tree is! What a twat of a tree. Stay away from that. Also some poo. I've been chased by poo. Oh, what the... Aye, aye! Yeah, there's some... Let's quickly um, sort that out. What the hell are you? Cthulhu, I mate. It's got a weird slime thing. And some mushrooms. Bloody hell, this plant's a weird one. Just going to see how I have a look down there. Oh, 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 oh. A multitudinous range of different dirty poos. I've, I'm still immune to poisons. Hooray! I'm also dying quite a lot here, because I suppose the, all the enemies are fairly rich in... Nastiness in extremis. Although this plant is pleasingly bouncy. Well, this bit is anyway. Doing, 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 doing. <laughs> Anything, any percentage in going any further down. Is that spider's web? It certainly is. Sticky, sticky webs. First spider silk I've had. Elder stone. Huh. Would like this. I feel something weird is about to happen. Ooh. Even more peculiar. It's like a flesh hell biome. What flesh hell is this? This is actually no, this is just red honey. It's not hell at all. Oh, these biomes really are mixed up and catastrophically odd. What's a bloody piss off your spiders? And of course, there was just a forest hanging out down here. Why wouldn't there be? I'm hoping there might be um, still no more. Still hoping for dungeons and things, but just being very unlucky in this one recently. Remember that stream we did, Fracking University, uh, ages ago, and I've just kept finding dungeons for days in that. It's not really much use, is it? Underground forest. I think there is an underground forest thing. Uh, I've never. S I can't remember really seeing them much before. See what's down here. Oh, it's a gnome village. Aww. Oh, bless. 
That's not really good. Not much good to us. Yeah, I think I'm going to make my way back to the surface anyway. Ow. Well, this um, this desert planet isn't all that. Although for some reason there are ice horses. You think they'd melt? But you know. Oh, <laughs> they winnied tragically as they shattered into a million pieces. And rightly so too. It's a nice little village. Oh, it's oak batteries. Actually, what is this stuff? Glowing sand. Hmm. Never seen that before. Well, snow planet, and we are in one of these kind of um, wooden mushroom places. I think we've got one of these on our bog planet, or somewhere I've been a lot recently. Um, I think there's actually a sort of like a dungeon underneath this, which I've never quite worked out how to access. So, salvage power coupling. It's a weird, weird thing to have in a one of those. It's the Grail. It's the Holy Grail itself. Also, look, this looks like a special bookcase shelf thing. Oh, I would have found a, a, an acoustic guitar. Oh, good. I'm stop playing bloody Wonderwall. And how do you? Okay, let's see. How do you actually? Let's let's work. Let's try and work it out. Oh. Oh. Maybe it was. The <laughs> maybe it was actually literally the bookcase then. Maybe that's the switch then. Huh. Maybe please know I found some food in the fridge up here. Delicious donuts. Ah, so it looks like if I can actually um, investigate whatever this is, then. Um, no, I can't see a thing. Um, let's see. Um, this is a bit of a cold planet, so I do need some protection, but we may actually have to put our light back on. Hmm. Uh, the temperature will be even colder. Ha. So is this going to be... I think this might be another case of light or... Hmm. Light or survive. Really could do with putting something else on. Uh, what do I need? Was it this one or...? No, it's actually heating. The heating thing, isn't it? There we go. It looks like there might be some light down here anyway. Presume a baddie. Presume <laughs> if that came out as English, I'm not quite sure. Uh, I think th this isn't actually on that tougher planet, so I'm hoping any enemies aren't too rampant in their shittery. Unfortunately, I did get caught out by a trap there, I think. Not some lovely mushies around, though. We may have to do a bit of this. It would be bloody night time, wouldn't it? Everything in this, everything in this video is always it always tries to conspire to make it night time. So, to make, to make it as difficult to watch the video as possible. I don't know if I can get... Oh, I can! Oh! Treasure map! Obviously can't get in there just yet. What's that done? Oh, you're just some bloke. Can Florin help you? Oh, I'm a Florin. Hello. I think it's a, it must be a prison cell. See, what I really could do with is having um, a shipmate who's got a light. Uh, so dark. I can't believe I just dark this torches as well. It just feels like it should be brighter. I don't know. Well, I've let them out for what good that did me. See what this is, if anything. Oh, hang on. N. The creature inside appears to be ready to emerge. Oh dear. Don't want that. Why don't I just release from there? I don't know. The faintest traces of iodine can be detected. Ah. Something's happened. Oh, we've got ourselves a shield. And also a, a mushy with a. Oh, don't do that to her! You evil prick. Just killed a florin. Oh, 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 oh that's actually death. Uh, death full of health, weirdly. Oh no, go, careful, careful. Right, so I'm, I'm in a sewer of some kind at the moment. Or well, was, anyway. I'm in another cell. 
Can I get in there? Ooh, what's that? It's a clock. Oh, I can get in here now. New quest. I've discovered the location of ancient ruins deep in a far-off planet's jungle. This could make for interesting exploration. Evernight jungle. Oh, hang on. Evernight jungle. That sounds familiar. Did we do that? At some point. I don't know. Ow. Anyway, I think I, I can now dig through the... Um, yeah. I can now dig through the walls. And get out of here. Oh, that was a... Oh, come on. Can I get out of here yet? This looks like just... Hmm, I'm not quite sure what this is. I can't get in there anyway. Well, I think I've actually done what I need to do here, haven't I? I can just find a way of beaming out. Oh, there we go. I've dug my way out. So you have a feeling this some um, this jungle quest is something I've done before. Well, that's interesting. Yes, um, episode eight post show for patrons only. <laughs> I did take on the Evernight Jungle, but I actually found the treasure map in, in a different way. Uh, I think it was um, via a place where I got to via a mech um, using Spoiler Ape and his cheese shark. Um, so yeah, I've already done that, so I'm not going to do it again. <laughs> if you want to see it, um, well, support the Patreon, I guess, and then <laughs> watch the Episode 8 post-show. Uh, remember when I did those? That was a long time ago. Okay, we'll finish up with just another a trip to a different... Uh, this is a different gas giant, actually a different um, solar system. And I just thought I'd have a bit more of a look around, just out of interest, just to see... Can I actually shoot my way through there? No, I can't. What's this? What's... Am I stuck somewhere? Um, oh dear. Um, <laughs> things have gone rogue. Hmm. What am I hurting on now? Shadow gas. I'm hurting on something. Maybe it's the, um, I don't know, I need to, unfortunately I've just lost my reaver, because things went a bit weird. So, we'll actually have to be the explorer part of the good old trusty, not at all broken. Hello! I think my ship just fell out of the sky. Excellent. Um, hang on. <laughs> Let's run out of here. I do appear to be slowly dying of... What is it I'm dying of? Not 100% sure. I will actually have to leave quite soon then. Oh! Ow! The hell were they? Huh. So they were actually some evil pricks. Uh, I think this might warrant further investigation. Let's go back down. The explore pod has exploded, but never mind. It must have been in contact. When I came in contact with something, it must have, um, that must have actually hurt me. Oh, interesting. Right, let's try this again. Oh, it's the shadow gas. Okay, so that... That is shadow gas. Right. So I've got to avoid that. It is a bit square. <laughs> um, so yeah. If I stay out of that, I should be okay. I didn't realise these planets were so complicated. I would vaguely... What's this? Is this almost... Oh, bollocks. I've just lost my... Oh! God damn it. Didn't realise I'd survived. Well, I've barely survived. Now I need to go and get my Reaver again. Piss off. Where is it? This cost ten quid or whatever the hell it cost. Deep in the heart of the shadow gas now. Oh, 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 there's my stuff. Loads of stuff. That's all my, that's all my stuff dropping in to this, to somewhere or other. Come back! <laughs> Please be so oh there we go. Got me stuff. Hey <laughs> This is peculiar. We may need to get out of here. Yeah. What a stupid place. Anyway, there we go. Everything's fine. Everything's fine. I'm staying off that planet. 
I need some shadow immunity. There is ways of getting around that. And so, no, really. I think there's some food we can get. But anyway, we'll stop here, um, because we've seen plenty of planets uh, and all that sort of stuff. So next episode will be episode 30. It might be the last one, um, because I might want to try and do some more vanilla builds type stuff soon again, because I haven't really done a build series recently. Um, so I'm, I'm having a bit of a think about that, and we'll see what happens. Also, will kind of like depend on um, the next proper Starbound update, which we still don't know when is going to happen. But I'll have a look um, um, on the blog and... Well, I'll, I'll keep I'll keep my eye on it. Uh, but anyway, until next time, thanks very much for watching, and I shall see you then. Bye.